Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back once again. My name is Bull, and this is going to be a brand new feature segment, whatever you want to call it, that I'm going to be calling Bull Direct Views Anime. Um, as many of you may know, uh, I'm a big fan of anime. I watch a lot of anime every single season. Uh, I try to keep up with um, a lot of the simulcast stuff that comes out, airing on Crunchyroll and Funimation. Um, and I, I just, I'm a big fan of anime. I'm really active over on RPG Net on the, the anime discussions over there. And I just really enjoy talking about anime and, and, and stuff. So since I watch so much anime, um, I figured one of the things I was going to do was I wanted to do anime reviews. Unfortunately, I'm finding that watching an entire season, while I can give an idea, I can give you a better idea of what I thought of the show as a whole, I don't always remember the little stuff that I really liked about each episode, um, and I don't have the time to go back and rewatch an entire series before I do a review. So rather than trying to do big series reviews, uh, what I'm going to try to do is do um, daily capsule reviews. Basically, uh, shortly after I watch an episode, I'm going to go ahead and give basically my immediate thoughts and stuff. I'm, trying to get a, I'm going to try to keep these to just a few minutes long, just a real quick, wow, that was a lot of fun, or wow, that was terrible, this was cool, this character did this, and it was really neat, and it was a lot of fun. Um, I will try to keep the spoilers to minimum, but I will say that there probably will be spoilers for that week's episode, so you should probably watch the episode. If, if you're interested in watching that particular show, you should wa probably watch the episode in question before you come and uh, watch my videos. So that's my plan, that's what I'm going to do, and that'll give me, you know, more videos for folks to check out and stuff as well. Um, I know my content's always sometimes a little hit and miss, so hopefully this will get me in the habit of recording more often and doing more stuff, and hopefully you guys will enjoy it. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, you know, hopefully this will be fun. We'll see how it works. Uh, I may not get all my, you know, I may I may miss episodes here and there. When I do, I will try to, you know, lump a couple episodes in together or whatever. Um, if there's any shows that are currently airing or even shows that uh, have aired in the past that you are interested in hearing my thoughts on, go ahead and, you know, leave me a comment in, below and I will either, I, I will either go ahead and check it out and post up a review or something like that. Uh, or I'll tell you why I'm not doing that. Uh, sometimes it's a matter of it's a show I've already seen and I don't really feel like watching again. Maybe it's a show that's got themes or whatever that I'm not particularly interested in watching. Um, everybody's got their own tastes. I know I do. Um, and I know that there's certain shows I found that I kind of have to steer away from. Uh, anime has a really, really nasty tendency to punch me right in the feels really hard. So some of the really emotional, dev emotionally devastating stuff tends to really, really just wreck me. Um, for example, uh, Canon, K-A-N-O-N, Canon from 2006, and uh, uh, Clanad and Clanad After Story, especially After Story. Holy crap, did those devastate me when I watched those. I mean, they were both really, really good and f largely very, very entertaining, but they just had some just emotional gut punches that just, especially at the time I watched them, just wrecked me for, like, days. And, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, I'm a big baby. <laughs> uh, I wear my emotions and my heart on my sleeve, and, you, I, you know, and these shows will really, really get to me sometimes. Uh, I also don't tend not to like the really darker or really, uh, you know, more depressing stuff. So, like, for instance, um, uh, what is the one, uh, When They Cry, Him Him Himigodo, or something like that. I don't remember the title off the top of my head. Um, that one, I've seen bits and pieces of it, and I'm like, or I've, I've, I've not seen bits and pieces of it. I've seen bits and pieces about it, and I'm like, hell no, I'm staying the hell away from that series, because that will not be fun to watch. So there's some shows I just can't watch. Um, there's a few things that I'm just not that interested. Uh, straight mecha shows. I love mecha, but like, like uh, you know, giant robots and stuff. But the more serious action-y ones, I tend just to find a little bit boring. I don't know why. I need a little bit more out of them. Um, mix in some comedy, and I'm usually good. Uh, I mean, two of my favorite shows are Martian Successor Nadesco and... Um, uh, Full Metal Panic, both of which are, to some degree, a mecha show, but both of them had some comedy mixed in. 
Uh, Martian success on Nadesco, or not Nadesco, uh, Full Metal Panic also has some, you know, school stuff mixed in. Plus they had an entire season that was just, you know, comedy stuff based on the school. I'm not necessarily counting, I mean, it was fantastic, don't get me wrong, Famufu was great. But I don't count, you know, I'm not counting that as part of the main series because, you know, it, it's, it's a very different thing. It, it was kind of more of just a comedy spinoff. Uh, but anyways, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy it. Uh, so check it out. Uh, you know, if you're interested in watching those, you know, please subscribe to the channel so that you can get uh, updates on a regular basis. Uh, like the videos when you like them so that I know what shows you're enjoying. Uh, please feel free to interact with me in the comments. I love hearing from people and I love discussing these. So, you know, I'd love to hear your thoughts, even if you disagree with me. Uh, you know, feel free to tell me. And again, if you have anything you want to watch, anything that you think I should be reviewing, let me know that as well, and I can add it to my list, or I can at least, you know, take a look at it and see if it's going to be for me or not. Sometimes it won't be, and like I said, I'll let you guys know when that's the case. So, also, uh, all of this is made possible by the wonderful support of my Patreon campaign, my patron backers, so that link is also in the description below. Please check it out, uh, and if you're interested, you know, you know, consider consider backing me, and uh, you'll get to see all these awesome videos, plus I do other stuff um, that uh, my Patreon backers have access to. Uh, some creative writing stuff, I do some hangouts, all that fun stuff, so... Alright, that's it for me. I'm all out of here. I'm going to make this one quick, because I'm going to actually go ahead and review my first anime after this. Uh, so we will catch you then. Have a good one!